It's hot girl summer bar right here. Just a summer girl, no hot. It's currently Friday night. This is our last night in Seattle. Tomorrow bright and early, we'll be driving from Seattle to Salt Lake City. It's about a 13 hour drive. We'll be going to Salt Lake City for a week and then Denver for about a month and a half. <laughs> about halfway to Salt Lake City. Take a small detour to Walmart. Um, we want to get subways for lunch. I felt that Walmart subway is the safest one, especially in uh, states and areas that we're not aware of. I think we're in Oregon, um, right on the cusp of the Idaho border. And we're officially mountain time. Six and a half hours done, six months out to go. I'm gonna get some subways and hit the road. We're making really good time, so let's go. into our Airbnb. The drive was 13 hours. We made four stops. Very tired. Um, but we made it and it was a pretty good drive overall. This is our Airbnb. We reorganized the living room and the dining room a little bit. And if you keep going, you'll get into the bedroom, which is Cora's setup. And the rest of the bedroom is pretty spacious and very bright. Good night. Bye. Sunday morning in the new Airbnb. Last night we slept horribly. The bed sheets were so crinkly and the bed is really soft. Tonight the plan is to use the day bed in the living room and then hopefully get a better night's sleep. Today we'll be exploring Salt Lake City downtown. I'm meeting up with M, who happens to also be in Salt Lake City to grab coffee. This is the outside of our Airbnb. It's not bad. It's wearing a jacket but it's actually very warm. Shades, who did this? Everything in downtown feels very clean and pretty dead today because it's a Easter Sunday pretty early in the morning. Yeah, I'm excited to get coffee and check out some bakeries. Going to Eva's bakery if Xavier's watching. Like favorite thing usually come in. Sure. Chocolate, almond croissant, and a ham and cheese. Yeah. Those biceps though, wow, you've been working out? It's hot girl summer bar right here. Just a summer girl, no hot. We're hiking up in Sime Peak. It is so hot. Half a mile hike up, half a mile hike down for views of the city and the mountains. Let's go. It's not crazy hot, but it's gonna be hot. We're going up there. Don't be downstream of me. You. We made it. It's a pretty good view for such a little hike. We have a whole view of downtown Salt Lake City. Yeah. And it's surrounded by all mountains. Also, the houses up here are so nice. They're yeah. huge, really well spaced out. Stay hydrated, right? Not sponsored. I wish. Bye. We're outdoor dining in downtown Salt Lake City. Ramen bar. We usually like don't get ramen, but it's like one of the fewer things that are open today. I'm but getting the curry udon. I'm getting the umami bomb. Yeah. We're gonna share, please. And this year, so yes. good. We're currently in the drive-through for Arby's. Want a smoothie? Jamoka smoothie. But it's around 5 p.m. We are fully refreshed with our afternoon siesta nap. 20 minute nap. And that shake was so big. Tomorrow I have to go on a four mile run because of this. But it was great. Arby's has good shake. Jamoka shake. Jamoka. 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 Chilling at Liberty Park for the last 30 minutes. The 
sun is so comfortable and warm. Very. It's still crazy how we're at Birkenstocks and shorts and t-shirts. Berks only. Wow. This muscle flex. Wow. This wraps up our first weekend in Salt Lake City. I really liked it. It's warmer than I expected and I'm just enjoying my Berks yeah. all day. See you next week. Bye.